Hello guys, what's up? Thanks for watching my video again. Welcome back to my channel again. Welcome back to Action Library. So today we are going to see the Marvel Legend Iron Man Mark 42, the rare one. Guys, it's not very rare. It's not very hard to find these days. That I bought it from a online page called Dara's. It cost 3000 taka plus delivery charge 200 taka. It was like too expensive, but I was forced to buy by my own self because it's very rare now. That's why. On the back, you guys can see there is some advertisement to buy all the other figures of this BAF wave of Iron Monger comic version 1. Uh, first one is um, the Iron Picture, the comic version 1, and Classic Iron Man, the comic version 1. And what is this? Um, yeah, Heroic Age Iron Man with left leg yeah, of this Iron Monger. It's the Infinity War one, yeah, I think it is one. And this is the Ultron, the comic version one, Ultron. And this is the Marvel Legend Iron Patriot. I'm really looking for this one also. If you guys know where to buy it in cheap, please comment down below and give me the link in the comment description. I want to buy the Iron Patriot also, the Marvel Legend one, here. I already have the, like, B comic version iron monger i bought i like bought the full bf iron monger ready made from like a facebook page like it was like the full bf iron monger i already bought it i will make a video on that too so i don't need the right arm that's for sale the this bf it's a nice packaging not that much bad and here is making the marvel legend iron man mark 42 and here is with the Marvel Iron Man here is written Avengers um initiative yeah age four plus but we should but I am age 30 plus lol and here is written Iron Man Mark 42 wearing the Mark 42 Tony Stark summons the power and might of any unit in his legendary armor so guys now let's crack this thing open by just a snap Oops, it got cracked. Um, so like, it was like intact, so I needed to tear with the knife, nothing to do. You guys also will need when you will buy this. So now let's get it out of the like packaging. Mmm, so nice. It's nice to touch and everything. Here's the beer part. And there's something else over here, guys. Is it a manual or something else? Oh, it's the BAF one. They wrote like in Japanese language, so I can't read anything. Because I can speak English and, and Bangla, obviously. So, is the Mark 42? Let's get this out of the like packaging. But it's too tight oh my god so guys i almost got this out oh my god guys i break it no guys i broke it yeah. just kidding i didn't break it But guys, the leg is having some problem. Like it's like turning left because it was in the packaging for like many days. Um, the figure is quite nice, not that much bad actually. But because of the paint job, the figure is like little bit uneasy. Yeah. And it can't stand properly that much. It can't. Wait, guys. Yeah. So now let's talk about the figure and the video first. Wait, guys. Let me set up my camera nicely. Yeah. So about the 
figures and the details of it. So, the figure, in, I mean, it's to me, it's very nice and shiny. Uh, first, let's talk about the articulation. The articulation is very nice. The, the, the pose articulation of the hand is good, not that much bad. It does with it 360 and uh, like elbow joint it does like uh, it does have articulation double jointed elbows and it does have torso movement it does with it 360 it does and the head sculpt it also obviously does with it 360 it does put it up and down um, it's like it's very good for flying poses it's very nice like iron man is flying it's very nice pose for him i really like this detail and like about the shoulder pad like it's only like rubber do not push any pressure on it then it will get cheered or broken or anything like don't push any pressure on it or on this figure just like treat it softly and about the leg, leg joint, it's very good, not that much bad. It does do it. And about the double joint knees, it's very good, but do not put your too much pressure on it. Yeah, then you will. Like it, it may break because these are made of rubber. These are the double joint it means. But I am as I have a sad thing about it. The packaging was like this, so like this leg was like this. So like it got like you know the shape is like now having a problem. And like about like these parts, the joints are very good, not that much bad. Mm. It does rotate, but do not push too much pressure. So now let's talk about the paint job. The paint job. The paint job is like good, not that much, like very good. I have many complaints about the paint job about this figure. Um, first, let's talk the positive side of this paint job of these figures. Then after positive, negative. Okay, the positive side. I really like the golden, shiny golden color of this figure. But there are more parts of this figure that they should have put more golden. And the silver color is very nice. I don't have any complaints. The silver color is very nice. And about the chest color. Um, shouldn't it be more like blue or anything? I think it should be more blue, like a blue or the dark blue. And about the like eye blue color, it's very nice, like dark black shaded, like good details about the eyes and the mouth. It looks like a sad Iron Man. Um, now let's take talk about the like negative side. Okay, so the negative side here, there should be more silver and golden color over here yep and here should be silver color too and the leg it needs more like silver and golden color this like full figure needs more like paint job details and over here these ball joints also need like more color paint jobs and over here these ball joints also need like silver color obviously there would be more good nice details like these details are also very good but like over here on the like neck part they should have put more like silver more silver and pin jobs like that much still a bit sad not that much but i am really satisfied with the figure and here they should have put more details on like, this flying face I'm really sad but I'm happy that I got a figure that's very rare now it was very hard to find 
I researched this figure for five years. I was searching for this figure for five years. Now it's 2019, and when I was searching for this figure for the first time, it was like 2015. No, no, not 15. I'm sorry. It was like 2000. Yeah, 15. Yeah. I started searching for this figure on 2015. Okay. So and on the hand, they should have put blue, obviously. For the repulsor, they put nothing here, just red. That kind of looks awkward. That's very bad actually. The, this figure, the articulation is very good and the figure's sculpting detail is very good and nice. But the most problem with this figure is there are two problems. The two problems are the paint job details of this figure and the uh, like packaging sculpt of this packaging that made the figure be damaged uh, that's the saddest thing it's also a nice figure it's not that much bad actually sorry guys Here's the figure. He's standing right here. So now let's talk about the like right hand B8 part of comic version Iron Monger. Um, let's unbox it it too. I already have a like, comic version Iron Monger because I collected all the B8 of comic version Iron Monger from a Facebook page. So nothing to review this one. I will review the full one on the like another video. I have the Iron Monger one. The video is coming soon. If you guys want, I will like to upload a next video. So please like hit the thumbs up button and share this video and comment down below. Like it has torso movement and like this part rotates and this has a movement too. Nothing to review about this one. So guys, let's get it to some pose. Um, I don't think so. I can get it on some pose. This figure. So guys, if you like my video, then comment down and share. Please hit the thumbs up button. And if you have any questions, comment down below. So see you on guys, so see you on guys on next video, peace.